this adjustment I go back to start up and the next step is pre-location also but we use now RM full feature that means um, arc refraction modes we use the TDR to get the picture and we use a high voltage to get a flash over and to change our high resistance fault into a zero ohm resistance fault okay let's switch it on adjust the output voltage we must remember by insulation test we get the information our output voltage or breakdown voltage was less than 2 kV so in this case it is a short kind of cable we can adjust 4 kV if it is a long distance cable and the breakdown voltage is much higher you can also adjust 16 or 32 system is now preparing okay now you see the the same picture like in TDR it's nothing different you can make the same adjustments you see the velocity is still uh, like in TDR mode but the pulse width has changed okay let's adjust it to 140 and you you see it is the same picture like before confirm confirm and now you must go into the mode store B and trigger that means now we will memorize the health picture the reference trace and now we will make a give a shock and uh, create a flash over and uh, a zero ohm resistance at the fault point okay let's switch it on system is asking me now high voltage on I confirm once here and with the green button here system is now preparing and you see automatically the next step is set voltage now I have to adjust the set voltage 4 kV confirm and if I want to give a shock now I can press thumb and system is now preparing the output voltage if it reaches the adjusted value we give a shock okay what we see now is a very bad picture because it's possible that the energy of our 4 kV impulse was not high enough so one step could be now we go back into the main menu and adjust uh, the same uh, op another output voltage up to 8 kV okay for that we have to switch off the high voltage we can do it here or directly here system is discharging now we have to wait okay you see now everything is okay and we go exit to start up go back to pre-location I'm full feature 8 kV to get a higher output voltage and now you see we have to adjust the same things like before pulse width to get the same picture confirm confirm go back store B trigger high voltage on once here and there set the output voltage I use now 8 and now I give one shock and you see now we get a very nice picture and what we see here is this is the beginning of our TDR the impulse is moving nothing is uh, different to the, the good to the health picture but at the end we get a flash over we create a zero ohm resistance fault by a flash over by the high voltage and a zero ohm resistance means in TDR measurings that the curve goes down to zero to minus and we're divided into two curves this is our point where our cable fault is okay that's it for pre-location after we get all the informations we can discharge again still discharging 
okay and then we go back to the main menu the next step is now uh, pinpointing pinpointing means we give a very uh, big shot into our cable into our fault we get a flash over and we detect the sound of the flash over by a digiphone so remember the last voltage we adjust we used 8 kV do the same now high voltage on the green button system is preparing now see red light is on high voltage in the first we can select now our set voltage we say 8 kV the second is we set our timer timer means we have an automatic or manual mode in automatic mode this is uh, the time delay between the shots so it's five seconds um, in this special case, to reach the maximum value, uh, we must adjust this to 6 or 7 seconds. For that we have to confirm, set timer, it's becoming yellow, now we can adjust the timer, confirm and we go back. To start automatic surging, we can do it here, then every 7 seconds we will give a shot, or we can do it by hand, single pulls, that is, when we confirm on this button we give only one shot so let's try it one shot you see the discharge and charging again the capacitor and system is now waiting for the next impulse or we can do it by automatic and now every seven seconds automatic we will give a shot now we have to go out with the digiphone to the point where our PDR or artifaction mode says that there is our failure approximately 100 meters, 1 kilometer or more and uh, a little about 50 meters before our value we should start with our pinpointing so that we are moving to our fault because if we are start behind our failure it's possible that we move away and so we will cannot find the fault okay and to switch off the system switch it off here or directly here that's it for pre-location and pinpointing